This is a problem that might bother some people or not at all. Let's say you've got a button and you've got quite long text and it's now wrapping onto the next row. Normally what happens is the text goes into the center and you might be happy with that style. But sometimes depending on the width, it might not look quite right. And sometimes reading is better left aligned. Let me just go to this button and let's just imagine I now made it a bit smaller or something like that. The and on going on to the next line, we get that kind of reversed inverted pyramid effect and it doesn't look so good. What you could do is left align it. And this is done with a little bit of CSS. So just create your button as you would, go and stick your text in, go to the advanced tab, go to custom CSS and that is all you need to drop in. Selector, elemental, button text. If you're gonna have a class name, get rid of the selector and go and put your class name in. Text align left. That's all it is, because when you get to the mobile, center align can look OK, but sometimes having left align works a little bit better. Now, I am not saying you have to be left align and you can't be center, because I will mix it up depending on design and the spec and what we're trying to achieve for the website. But if it knocks you kind of thing or you're looking at it and going, it doesn't look quite right or whatever, or maybe it's quite lengthy text, please remember, this could be a button. Most buttons are like, click here, contact me, get in touch. But what if the button is like a call to action and you've got some lengthier text in there? You know, something like this. And I've gone and added in loads of text and breakpoints. The left align works a little bit better, don't you think? Hey, the code for this is in the video description. I'm Imran from Web Squadron. Like, subscribe, share and follow. Catch you later. See you soon. Take care. Bye. Never break. Always fight. Never quit. Do it right. Play the game. Win it life. Have no shame. There's no time.